Test Line Rant episode 106. Thank you very much for tuning in. in, 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 in. Full boy shoes is what you need. Get the power on your feet. With full boy shoes, you get a free pair of shin pads. Signed by me, Alan Hansen. We are joined this week by Craig, manager of CSKA Sapphire Garden. Say hello, Craig. Hello. There, that's Thank you him. for having me. That's the, the aforementioned. Proud sponsor. Craig, yeah, we're proud. You know, the team that we proudly sponsor, Front of Shit, uh, CSKA Sapphire Gardens. And the last of Rue League. We have got a sponsor this week, again, from the wonderful Welsh Ice. GSD Media. They offer f- photographic and video services for corporate clients. Like what? Like weddings. Uh, celebrations, sport events, um, charity fundraisers, anything. Social media, all that sort of thing. Yeah, anything, mm-hmm. anything. Um, they've worked with uh, well, marketing. Welsh Ice, our friends at Welsh Ice, they've worked with them. They've worked with Welsh Gymnastics, Deloitte, the BBC, did coverage for the London Marathon. If you want to find out about GSD Media, please email hello at gsdmediauk.com and see what they can do for you. On the agenda tonight, Thank our you. featured game is... Liverpool versus Leicester, which is going to be a hum dinger. Preview the rest of the Premier League. That CSKA chat. CSKA chat. Championship corner. And we're going to reopen the door to the Kind Club. Um, kind Club. Which we opened last week. Our new feature, which celebrates the positive elements in football. Because we're Very sick and tired of the negative ones. Very successful. Uh, then it says outro, where we will go home. All right, play the music. rest of the Premier League I quite like the look of Brighton versus Tottenham right now uh, no, I, 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 I don't think I'd like to watch that as we said last week is you've got to realise it's Spurs they don't win anything yeah. that's what Spurs <laughs> do um, sorry Spurs fans what, but Spurs don't what's, win what, when you we, say, what's, ha- what's happening behind the scenes to Spurs Oh, lots of stuff's happening Daniel Levy won't release fans there's loads of uh, what else I don't think there's we're loads of nothing else there's lo- no, not that I can think nothing, of. Nothing, no, else nothing. Nothing that somebody we had a black eye or something. Certainly yeah. nothing yeah. that we could say on a recording. <laughs> so my favourite players are Ericsson, Levertonghen, and yeah. Harry Kane. <laughs> they are they are good players. Though. Ericsson is one that is definitely. My you need to keep all of them together, very closely. Yeah, yeah. Like, play, um, play them as a front three be, or something. It needs right. to be tight, like a sandwich attack. <laughs> Arsenal, Arsenal, let's talk Arsenal, Arsenal, Bournemouth. Let's talk Arsenal. It's, I think Arsenal will sneak it. I think it's going to be a 2-1, two, two, maybe a 1-0. No, but it's Arsenal because they won't keep a clean sheet. 2-1. Do, do you know what I realised no. as well recently? Unai Emery, he is Dracula. <laughs> yeah. He's such score? a cool vampire. <laughs> um, <laughs> Bournemouth like to score goals. Uh, so, and Aubameyang's going to score. So I'm going to go highly and I'm going to say 3-2 to Bournemouth. Imagine looking over if you're an Arsenal player and you, and you see Emery doing this. <laughs> He's not gonna let it go. He was going ballistic. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't like that. That's probably what stepped them like up a peg. Nosferatu on the side. Full boy shoes is what you need. Get the power on your feet. With full boy shoes, you get a free oh. pair of shin pads. Signed by me, Alan Hansen. What do we think of Bernardo Silva? Um, I didn't like him at first. I think he's great now. I know what you're hinting at. I, d- I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, you do know what you're talking about. <laughs> do you think that was a Do you think about. it was a fair, fair slap on the wrist? The tweet he he, he tweeted. Oh um, yeah. Mendy. Yeah. Now he is now. Pep came to his. And Pep did, like Pep fueled the fire. Defense. Pep fueled the fire more. Can, can they go and have to defend? Can him. I just say Bernardo Silva thing? Including it looks like Guardiola himself. You. It's never okay. Right. You can be. In 99.9% of your life, not racist, you can you can not be a racist, but you can do a stupid racist tweet on Twitter. It is po- So them saying, you don't know him like I know him, he's not racist. No, no, no. Okay, fine. I, you know him far better than me. I will, take your, I will take your word that he's not racist. However, he did something that was racist. Uh, sorry, I think Chelsea will beat Southampton. 
I think Man City will beat Wolves. And then I think I probably Newcastle Wait. will beat Man United. Hey, they said it's offside hit my, I didn't. I hit it twice, hit me, bobbed up, that's why I done Foster. It's a joke. I've gone about VAR this, VAR that. Help the officials out. Clearly they need help. Clearly, we play in the Premier League, the best league in the world, the most watched league in the world. I give them all the help they need, because clearly it cost us two points a day. It's a joke. Put all that to bed. This week worked hard, come here to get three points. We deserve three points today. We've been let down by the officials, that's why we didn't get three points. I can't... Well, your anger basically tells the whole story, doesn't it? Refresh, two weeks, come back, big game, away to Fulham. We are joined by Craig at CSK Spy Gardens. Thank you for coming in. Hello again, thank you for having me. How is the season going for you? It's going very well. I um... Lovely kit, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> the kit is an absolute dream. It's a dream. We, it's a dream we to play in. the kit. Your nice. sponsor looks great along the front. It does look really good. And for good, a great, great cause. It's uh, it's nice to get all the boys involved. Um, it's um, it's it's what we're all about. We just uh, we want everybody involved as much as possible with the club, um, and it's why we keep going and why we keep why we're so well run. We um, uh, this team's folding left, right, and centre every single year, yet we keep getting stronger and stronger, and that's all because of the support of the lads and the support of outside influencers like, like, like you guys as well. Well, it was for a good cause. That is that. We're selling the shirts. I have more sales over there to give Craig after we finish recording this. It's Brilliant. a business to give to Joey. Absolutely amazing. It's business and pleasure. All profit made from it. Is and it's a lovely shirt. It's a sexy, lovely, isn't it? It's a lovely mm. shirt. Many will go to the Wallet. Should we leave it on the Wallet? Yeah, yeah. And if I'm not on ATR, I'll listen to it too. So I'll think about that. Never ever, also, have I seen United players crowd the ref like little piss ants. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's really embarrassing. It is embarrassing. It's not good enough. Like, Jesus Christ, some of the tackles were just going in and they are just pissing and moaning. Yeah. It's desperation. It smacks of desperation. I know they're under pressure. However, yeah. then, then, it really right. annoyed me because they've that's never been that... The, that's back to the old days. It's never been that type of team. Referee, it's though, just it? bullshit. And this is where we've always differed it's on just Man trash. United. It's being a Man United fan, it's not just about them being under pressure. It's also about the bulk of that team being in it, inadequate to play for Manchester United. Mm. Leno... Pulled off some immaculate saves in the wet. Your goalkeeper's in the wet. It's insane mm. how hard it actually is. No one said that. And to just churn out a one all yeah, yeah. in those conditions, in under that pressure, Salah. for kids, Gundozi, <laughs> Gundozi's energy again shined through as a beacon. He was yeah, everywhere yeah. as much as possible. Dan the James was phenomenal, well causing so many issues. And I thought Paul Pogba was pretty good. Mm. What's this Lingard stuff as well? Why is everyone so harsh on Lingard? Okay, because. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. But he d deserves. Just to no. mention, not to be blamed for the entire downfall. No, of it's not. There's, there's a few people. Around. However, Jesse Lingard has got. Bear in mind, Jesse Lingard plays an attacking right wing, front of the part of the front three. Yeah, he plays as part of the attacking front three. Like, look at Liverpool: Mane, Salah, Firmino. That's the quality you're putting up. Yeah, that's who you've got. You're challenging. You play for got, fucking Man United. Got that, and though. he is playing in a position where he needs to get assists and goals. That's part of the deal. You need to get assists and goals. He's got four in the last 18 months. But he says it, but everybody's been saying he's, he's a hot prospect for years and years and years and years. Yeah, and he's, and he's, 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 he's too old. That. He's getting older and older now, you know. At 27, you can't be, you can't be a prospect. <laughs> it's like Theo Walcott. Say okay. it with some enthusiasm. Right. It's a good thing. It is a good Positivity thing. Positivity shining on everything explain, like a beacon of hope. Explain what kind uh, club is. Sell it to me a little bit. Explain Ooh, it to what it is. So kind is. Club is, some, is an idea, concept for we've just stolen off your daughter. So your daughter, Sydney, started a club in school. No, she didn't get asked to, she just did. She mm -hmm. just started Kind Club. That's nice. It's so nice. I thought, let's steal that. The real kind club that we've stolen from. Yeah. Uh, from my daughter. She started in school and related to football. They had their first week at kind club this week. The official yeah, yeah. kind club. She's had the applications in. She's got yeah, her yeah. members on board. Nice. Yeah. She had to kick one of the kids. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's what happens. That's what I said. Yeah, that's, this is what I, happened to you. I'll tell you to st sit across the other side. Where I see Kind Club going, I want a properly like Life Aquatic, Steve Zizou style merchandise. I want you to have like a membership card, some pin badges, a kind a kind journal. I think it could spread 
Like diaspora, <laughs> like a dandelion in the wind. Football's we, kind club. We've introduced into kind club. As it our, went down a treat. It did, as our first guests came in were Roma. <laughs> and specifically the Roma English, uh, the Roma transfer tweets they did this summer. Fantastic. Where yeah. every time a player got announced... Five children, found. This time I want to... I wanna, you're not going to... You'll never guess. Um, I know who he's going to bring in to kind of <laughs> and I still can't believe it. No, no, Christopher no. Smalling. Chris, Chris Smalling, Smalling. Is, 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 is a registered member of Kind Club. Not too many footballers come out with saying they're vegans. But uh, they've, he's come out and said he's, he, he is vegan and it helps him to bounce back. He bounces back faster, he said. He used the term bouncing back from injury faster, being a vegan. Probably for health reasons rather than moral, but I don't care, I don't mind it. It's a, it's a, it's a cause for good, back. more positivity in football. Come back next more week and maybe... Yeah, yeah, so kind yeah, that's, that's kind yeah. of, you've had a peak, like you you've had a peak into a, kind club. There. A, what do you reckon? A karma <laughs> army, if you will. It's a, a karma army. It's uh, bringing kindness to the world, I think. More of it. More <laughs> yes, bloody of it. Thank you. Oh, thank you very much. Cheers. Oh, sweet, oh, sorry. What with this one here? You're going to have a bite. Thanks. Thanks, Thanks Jabs. Cheers. Oh. Ah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Thanks. A few exciting things to remind you of. We are going to be doing two shows in Australia. What have we um, learned from this week? I've learned that you shouldn't be too quick to judge. Thank you to GSD Media for sponsoring us this week. You can find them at GSD Media UK on Instagram and on Facebook. That's it. Thank you. Is that it? Yeah.